Nazi hell on earth, how I escaped the deadliest march in history. As I sit here, reflecting on my past, I am reminded of the unimaginable horrors I endured during World War II. The Nazi regime's brutality and cruelty knew no bounds, and I was one of the unfortunate souls forced to experience it firsthand. The unthinkable begins. It was January 1945, and the Soviet army was closing in on the Eastern Front. The Nazis, desperate to maintain control, ordered the evacuation of prisoners from various concentration camps. I was among the thousands of prisoners forced to embark on the infamous Nazi death march, a journey of no return. The march was a relentless, merciless trek through treacherous terrain and harsh weather conditions. The Nazis provided little to no food, water or shelter, leaving us to fend for ourselves. Prisoners were beaten, shot or left to die if they couldn't keep up. Survival against all odds. I witnessed unimaginable atrocities along the way. The guards' cruelty knew no bounds and prisoners were treated like animals. Yet amidst the chaos and despair, I found moments of hope and resilience, a glimmer of hope. One day, a fellow prisoner shared a piece of bread with me, a small act of kindness that gave me the strength to carry on. Another time, a guard's momentary distraction allowed me to grab a few extra seconds of rest. The breakthrough. After weeks of marching, our group reached a rural town. In the chaos of relocation, I spotted an opportunity to escape. With a deep breath, I made a run for it, dodging guards and disappearing into the nearby woods. Freedom's sweet taste. The feeling of freedom was overwhelming. I had survived the unthinkable and a new chapter began. I spent months in hiding, eventually reconnecting with Allied forces. Reflections. Looking back, I realized that my survival was a testament to the human spirit's capacity for resilience. The Nazi death march was a horrific chapter in history, but my story serves as a reminder that even in darkness, Hope and courage can prevail.